Hey guys, it's Ty. Welcome back. Hold on. Better. A little blurry for me. Um, so today I have for you guys a haul from Joann's. Um, I had to go out and get vinyl today, which is like 35, 40 miles away. Um, so I figured while I was there, I went to Hobby Lobby, Michaels, and Joann's. And Joann's was the only place that I found anything that I wanted. So I got some stuff for me and I got some stuff for y'all. Um, and they also had all three stores had some type of like mega clearance event. Except Hobby, well Hobby Lobby had stuff on clearance. Um, like, I think it was like home stuff or something. It was like 75% off. And then they had... Um, the spring shop stuff was 50 but I think that was just like regular sale. And then at Michael's, they had clearance event. Um, if the stuff had a yellow or a... I don't remember. It was two colors. Maybe yellow and blue or yellow and something. You took an additional amount off of the ticketed price. And then at Joann's, it was, um, it was kind of mixed. Like, I know anything to do with paper crafting, you got an additional 25, yeah, no, 30% off. They had stuff for additional 20% off, stuff for additional 25% off. So, it just depended on what you got. Um, also, I apologize if you hear the whining in the background. The guinea pigs are doing their weird noises again. Um, so anyway, let me show you what we got. <coughs> So I got another pack of the cards and envelopes. It is part of the Park Lane stuff, ready to print, inkjet only. But I didn't get them to use them as cards. Um, I wanted to see about making some more of the card, uh, like flip book type things. So they had them on clearance originally $8.97 and they were on clearance today for $4.47 and then there's an additional 30% off or whatever and it was 313 for a pack of 50 not bad the rest of the stuff was just whatever the clearance price said so I got me and you each one of these it is the punch board by we are memory keepers and it is for a gift box punch board and this was on clearance for 847 so I got one and you got one and then Sabrina was the one who had this the other day and I saw it and I wanted one like this as well and it is the EK tools um, scoreboard there we go um, this is the big one and it was on clearance for 947 so I went ahead and picked this up um, because I have a scoreboard that is attached to, uh, um, like it's an all-in-one with the cutter, but I wanted a separate one because sometimes it's just aggravating getting that out after I put it, because I cut everything out and then I'm like, okay, I need a score. But then I got to pull it right back out. So this way I can have this. I don't have to worry about flipping that blade back and forth because I have actually stabbed my arm on that thing and it's not super bad, but yeah. Uh, so I try this way I don't have to um, watch my arm where it goes on the side because I'm not gonna risk puncturing myself if that makes any sense and then to go along with that I got you guys the small EK tools scoring board this is the zero to six it's a mini scoreboard it comes with a little tool as well and uh, this was 647 so not a bad deal at all and then on the back it shows you um, that they also have an envelope scoring board you could buy uh, right there but I already have the we are memory keepers one so I don't have to buy that but that one looks kind of complex compared to the other one but it's probably easy to use but it just looks a little complex so anyway these two items are for you guys. And you're probably wondering, well, when are we going to get them? So, 
the question, the answer to that question is, I am going to be doing another crafting challenge, um, probably in the next month or so, give or take a couple weeks, whatever. Um, I kind of know what I want to put as the craft, like the main, um, make it you enter type thing. So, you guys keep your eyes and ears open for that. That way you can enter if you would like to win those things. So far, um, I'm doing, I think I'm going to do two winners. And one is going to have the big prize of the, the punch board. And the other one is going to have the scoring board. But there's going to be other goodies with it too. So, down below, tell me... What other stuff you guys would be interested in winning um, as part of a challenge giveaway? Because unless I can find another set of those two items. But that was those were the last two um, scoreboards at the store. As well as the last two punch boards at the store. So it just depends on... Um, what I can find but anyway so let me know down below what you guys would want to go with that if that makes sense or are you just looking for like odds and ends just like a mix of something um, just give me some ideas please and that's everything I bought from Joann's and it was only 36 bucks which is not bad considering that big punch board has to be way more than 950 and those like the scoreboard it was marked at 947 it has to be way more than that and the punch boards at 847 i paid more than that for a punch board at tuesday morning one time so i don't know what they're really valued at but pretty good deals if you ask me but yeah, so oh, and I also went to Home Goods. I didn't find anything good there. It was kind of empty, actually. Like as I was walking around looking at stuff, it was like bare minimum on the shelf. Like especially like in the kitchen sec section and stuff, they had a good bit of stuff. But like when you got to towels, the linens, um, it was just enough to put on the shelf, I guess. And as far as like the furniture goes, they didn't really have a whole lot of choices if you were looking for any specific pieces. Um, so I don't know if they're not getting trucks or like how that's working, but they did have some really nice floor markers. Cause like everywhere you go, there's now floor markers to like how to walk. And they had some really nice ones. I know it's a weird thing to say, but yes. Um, and also, if you guys saw yesterday's video with me feeding the squirrel, today we took it a step further, and instead of handing him a whole peanut, like the shell and all, I shucked him, and I gave him just the individual pieces, and he took them out of my hand, and he ate them. He's like my new best friend. I just want to touch him. That's my next step. But I got to get him to trust me. A little bit more before I can reach my hand out and pet him um, so we'll see how that goes because there are three black squirrels that come around my yard and there's a handful of brown squirrels or brownish reddish I'm not sure what they are called exactly that come but the brown ones they don't get anywhere close to you <clears throat> but the black ones they tend to stay um, like, even if you're outside, they'll stay on the fence. They won't run up the tree and hide from you like the brown ones will. But that specific one is the only one that has come down for me to feed it or even for it to be anywhere near us. So, that was pretty neat. But I did see the other black squirrel today, and he didn't even try to come and say hello. Did his buddy not tell him how cool of a friend I am? Just say. Anyway, I... We'll go complain to somebody about the squirrels. And I hope you guys had a wonderful Monday, if that's even a thing, to have a wonderful one, right? So, 
I will stop rambling. Let me know down below, like I said, your choices for a prize to go with, along with those things. And um, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, y'all.